Jungle Encounters is a nonprofit organization focusing on protecting the small wildcats of Belize. Our mission is to ensure Belize's small wildcats remain wild, protected, and with plenty of habitat to live in and expand onto. Belize is a small Central American country that is home to five species of wildcats, the jaguar, puma, ocelot, margay, and jaguarundi. Extensive research and conservation efforts have been done on the jaguar in this country, and due to the similar behavior patterns of the puma and ocelot, these conservation practices have helped to protect them as well. Our trail camera research is on the lesser studied felines, the margay and jaguarundi. These species tend to stay away from the larger cats, and so their behavior hasn't been fully captured in these larger jaguar studies, making the current conservation efforts not as effective for these smaller felines. The margay is Belize's smallest wild cat, weighing in at 5 to 8 pounds. It is extremely nocturnal and has developed very large eyes to see at night. It is highly arboreal, spending most of its time in the trees hunting and resting only coming down to the ground to patrol its territory. This species has taken to the trees to get away from the threats on the ground and have evolved flexible ankle joints that can rotate sufficiently enough so maneuvering through the trees is effortless. It is very secretive and hardly ever seen, making it tricky to gather information on for conservation purposes. The second smallest Belizean cat is a jaguarundi, weighing about 15 pounds. It is the only truly diurnal cat in Belize, spending its days hunting and patrolling its territory. Unlike the margay, jaguarundi are ground dwellers and tend to prefer open grasslands with scrub brush areas to hide in and cool off in. They are a very vocal feline, using up to 13 different calls to communicate with each other. Our work is collecting data on these two wild felines using trail cameras. This data is used to analyze the behavior patterns of these cats to determine best conservation practices for these unique species. Landscape fragmentation is one of the small wildcats' main threats. Our data is helping the Belize Foundation for Research and Environmental Enrichment, Be Free for short, by documenting the wildlife in their cacao crops. The seeds from cacao trees are processed to create chocolate which gives villages a source of income. Be Free is working on introducing certain species of trees to the crops to make the crops grow better. And it is also providing a mini canopy layer over the crops that act like bridges connecting the jungles. We are working with Be Free to analyze the progress of their work, which will then be shared with the local villages so they can practice this improved version of agroforestry. Margay and Jaguarundi are a valuable agricultural asset because they prey on the small mammals that destroy crops. Over the past four years, we've gathered valuable data on these lesser known species and will continue our research for years to come. Our main expense is trail camera replacement. Due to the harsh tropical environment, we are re replacing an average of 15 to 30 of our trail cameras each and every year. We rely heavily on donations from people like you to help cover these equipment costs. Without you, this project would not be where it is today. We want to thank you for taking the time to learn about our project, and if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. For more information on our work, please check out our website and follow us on Facebook.